Hey you guys, welcome back. Today I wanted to sit down and share some grooming tips for women. Now these are small tips and hacks that I know for a fact is going to enhance the way you take care of yourself. Um, and I really hope that you guys enjoy this. And before we go ahead though, if you are new to my channel, I would love it if you guys subscribe to my channel and also hit on the bell icon so that you're notified whenever I have a new video out. And let's get started. The first thing is something that you can do every other day or twice a week to begin with and this is for those of you who suffer from chapped lips or if you feel like your lipsticks don't really sit well now this is something that is so easy you just use your toothbrush once you're done brushing your teeth and then just go ahead and rub it onto your lips just make sure that you're very very gentle and this way is gonna scrub out all of the dead skin cells and it'll always remain soft it is so easy it's only going to take you like 30 seconds and I'm sure you guys brush your teeth every day so I know for a fact that you're not going to forget this step and it's going to make sure that your lips stay soft and also make sure that you apply a lip balm immediately after okay so the next tip is for those of us who are above the age of 25 uh, so we need to start incorporating anti-aging processes and treatments into our regime one of my favorite things to do is actually massage my skin to massage my face I love using Using products like this like a gua sha or a facial roller and I like to use this with products that help with anti-aging so I wanted to introduce you guys to a new range from Lotus Organics this is their Bakuchiol plant retinol super serum and their plant retinol miracle face oils as the name suggests this is a plant retinol based product so it has Bakuchiol which is um, extracted from the leaves and stems of Bapchi plant and um, because it's plant derived it's 100% vegan and it does the exact same thing uh, that retinol does so it really helps in the process of anti-aging and by that I mean that it really helps in increasing the cellular regeneration it helps in um, tightening the appearance of pores it also helps in producing more collagen which further helps in reducing um, the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles and this is something that I would usually include in my nighttime skincare routine um, I like to add retinol to my routine at least once a week if not twice and I usually like to use it in the night and to use this you first take the plant retinol super serum just a little bit goes a long way it's very lightweight and it's specially formulated for th those of us with oily and acne prone skin so you can just take this and apply it and it just soaks it in very quickly and then the next step is to use the plant retinol miracle face oil I I love love the texture of the oil and is actually very important that you always layer up your serum with something that just uh, locks it in so you just take like two drops of this oil it's very lightweight and you apply it all over your face um, it feels very therapeutic to do this I just want you guys to take out like 10 minutes off of your time and just spend it with yourself and I'm telling you you are going to see the results all you have to do is then take your gua sha you can use this cold I like to keep it in the fridge so that it's nice and cold and then I just like to massage it on an upwards motion like this so this way uh, the product is really beautifully uh, massaged into your face and you're also increasing your blood circulation your lymphatic drainage and gua sha even to an extent um, helps in smoothening out any wrinkles and the appearance of wrinkles or fine lines on your face so the combination of bakuchiol and the gua sha is like absolutely perfect in case you are looking for for um, a skincare routine to uh, prevent any sort of aging. The next tip is for those of us who tend to forget our eyelashes and eyebrows in our skincare routine and I have to say that I'm guilty about that one and it's really easy to take care of it. All you need is an empty uh, mascara tube and you fill it up with some castor oil and some vitamin E oil that you can get from any vitamin E capsules and then you can just take this uh, mascara wand and apply it 
every morning and every night and castor oil it makes such a difference and using it in a tube like this just makes it very easy to apply as well next tip is for your underarm grooming and I prefer to shave my underarms and um, this is something that I like to use I love using like using throw razors I think they're so um, hygienic and inexpensive and um, I think there are a lot of myth around shaving and people sometimes don't really enjoy it uh, but for me I have really liked using it if some if you're looking for like a more permanent way to um, remove your hair in your underarm uh, then you can also use a personal device like this one from Erica um, it's a laser hair reduction that you can do at home and uh, I or you can even go to like a professional who do it in their clinic I have recently tried that as well and if you are someone who faces like pigmentation and discoloration in your underarm area then you can try a product like this this is the bare body underarm cream which is designed and formulated specifically to reduce any sort of pigmentation and discoloration and really even out the skin tone in your underarm you just take a little bit of the cream it's a very lightweight and then just massage it in your underarm every single day once you're done with your shower one of the best decisions in my life was to start using menstrual cups and it has definitely changed the way like my periods um, ha like changed the experience of periods for me it's it's so fuss free so if you haven't tried menstrual cup already I think it's a great switch um, I know a lot of us still prefer like pads um, over like tampons or cups but something like this makes your periods so fuss free so if you haven't tried this I would highly recommend that you do so and I have a full video explaining how to insert it how to use it how to remove it and how to take care of it in um, I've already done a video on that so I'm gonna leave that here so you guys can watch it but another thing that you can add on to your intimate hygiene is actually use panty liners I think you can use panty liners um, on period days and non period days and I feel like it just soaks up any of the excess moisture be it sweat or discharge and it just keeps your intimate um, area clean and hygienic it's a very small and you can just stick it onto your panty and for um, intimate wash I love using this one from Sirona uh, this is the refreshing intimate wash with Tasmanian pepper fruit oud oil coconut oil and olive oil and I like this because it's uh, soap free so um, it does lather up but there is no sulfate in it and it also really helps in maintaining the uh, pH of your intimate area and I absolutely love the smell of it I think it's very very divine and lastly I had one more tip for your hair care I'm sure a lot of us like use coconut oil or olive oil to oil our hair um, I would just recommend that you add a, a quick hot towel wrap after you're done doing your chumpy because I feel like the steam really helps in uh, the oil penetrating the shaft hair shaft really easily and better um, and for that all you have to do is just heat a wet uh, towel um, in the microwave for exactly one minute I remember seeing a video on TikTok about this and I tried it and it really worked well for me uh, so exactly one minute not too less not too much or else you could burn your hand and be absolutely careful um, so you um, wet the towel and then you heat it up in the microwave for one minute and then you go ahead and of course you're gonna uh, put the towel in after you squeeze out all of the water and once you take out the hot towel and then uh, you just wrap it into your hair after you've oiled your hair and I feel like that will make such a good difference um, it's just such a add-on to already oiling your hair so yeah those were all of the tips that I wanted to give in today's video I hope you guys enjoyed this all of the products that I have mentioned here will be linked below in the description box so make sure you check that out and uh, that's it thank you so much for watching i hope you guys subscribe to my channel for more videos and i will see you in my next one bye